Well, the Monfield Police Department made a fourth grade student with leukemia's dream a true reality. Channel 3's Olivia Schuler takes us now to Charles E. Murphy Elementary School in Oakdale, where a future police officer is in the making. It was a lift to school nine-year-old Maya Harvey was not expecting. I knew that the police people were coming, but I didn't know it was going to be extra special. Last Monday was not like every other Monday morning school drop-off. Maybe change it up a little. Amaya got picked up by SRO Karen Ailshire. It couldn't have been any better. Amaya was in control of the sirens, lights, and horns as she was escorted to school by two dozen police cruisers. When we looked in our rearview mirrors, um, all we could see were police cars, lights, and sirens going all the way down Route 32. It was a dream fulfilled by Groton, Colchester, and Montville law enforcement agencies. Amaya's mom wrote a simple email to police saying her daughter had leukemia. The note read, one of the times we were admitted, she said how cool it would be to be able to ride in a police car with police and the sirens going. SRO Elshire made that happen and then some. Four canines were there that came in and ate with Maya and then uh, the fire trucks came up to the school and uh, Maya even got to climb on top of a ladder truck. Yep. It was moments that reminded Amaya why she wants to be a police officer herself. I definitely love like, helping people. The tiny yet tough nine-year-old is getting treatment for leukemia. At eight years old, she told an adult she had chest pain. I thought this is all just like a dream, I'll be fine, until I got the shocking news. To stay strong, she reminds herself of these three words. Never give up. Every day that passes, she knows she's one step closer to being in a police badge with her canine sidekick. A day she's already lived out once. In Oakdale, Olivia Schuler, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.